Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. We're just getting loaded up. That's my squeaky door. We are going to the river and we're gonna catch some fish. So catch you guys there. Well y'all, we made it to the river. Now let's go catch some fish. We're gonna catch all the fish in the whole river. No, you don't look very, uh, you're just laughing at me. <laughs> and there's all kinds of stuff washed up today. That was a good one. Got one. Oh, he came off. I had a little bass right here. Oh, my tail's almost bitten off. Look at that. And I straightened my hook out on a rock. Whew, it gets a little deep over here. Oh. Dang. Look at this. Oh, I'm up to my, up to my neck. Oh, my tail fell off. Just keep that reel out of the water. I need to go get a new bait. Now we got a white twisty tail. Let's see if this works. Here's a little baby carp. Right there, you see it? Oh yeah. You wanna snag him? Oh, you almost hit. Get him. <laughs> oh, yeah, no. oh. Oh, yeah, you got oh, was he used for bait? He, he got him right there, right there. I didn't do that. I think he was used for bait. See, it looks like somebody hooked him oh. and then let him go. He, he's dead. Almost dead. You gave him a little miniature heart attack. Go see if those dudes want him for bait. Remember, six feet, social distancing. I just had a little catfish on. Oh, yeah, I had him right here. Oh, there's a spider on there. Are you kidding me? How the hell did that happen? I think I'm gonna go with the one size lighter than this. This is a quarter ounce. And it's just a tad bit heavy, I think. Well, y'all, I got skunked today. But uh, we lost two bass and a catfish. But um, it is what it is. Hey y'all, round two of the river fishing session. We have a little bit smaller road runner. We're gonna give this one a try. Oh, 
Got one already. Yes. There we go, boys. That was like my fifth cast. What kind of bass is this? This is the ticket. Look at this. This is the perfect size. One eighth ounce. There's one surface right there. Got him. Oh. Well, I missed one. Caught one. They're holding up right here on the edge of this current. They're liking this like twitch. Which, slow it down, see that? I got another hit. Got him. Keep him low, keep him low. Yes! A little largemouth. I found the pocket, babe! Second one already! That is a little largemouth. It's pretty rare that the Colorado is this clear. Look at this. We're gonna see if we can get a good release on this guy. Hey you guys, so this river here, you got the fast current and then it goes into this slower current area and I've just been fishing the edge of it. I'll just make a cast out into the current and then let the, let the line drift down and right there at the edge of the current and the slack water is where I've been getting the hits. And then on the retrieve, you can just do a straight retrieve or you can pause and just kind of twitch it a little bit. Ooh, ooh, I had a bite right there. There are bluegills out here too. They've been they've been nipping the butt of my bait all day. But yeah, just like that. Cast it out into the current and then just let it drift down. Once it starts getting towards the edge, start reeling it in, twitch it a little bit. And that's how I got all my bass today. Where's he going? Where's he going? What's he doing? There's the ticket right there. One eighth ounce all white Roadrunner with the Crappie Thunder trailer. There it is. Hold it. I'll cut it. Now you're strapped. Since I caught a couple bass, no one wants to come give it a try. So I had a spare rod in my truck. Lucky boy. What? Yeah, once I started catching them. They're probably holding on the other end of this current too. It got picked up. Yeah, as soon as it went over in that slack water. Ooh, that was a hit. Remember the last time we tried to fish over here? You lost your shoe, you cut your foot. It's so much nicer like this. You still getting bites over there? How big? No, I'm picking out a backlash. So this is kind of cool. Look at all of these wild grapes. See that? 
So if you don't catch anything, at least you won't starve. They do have seeds in them, but they taste really good. And then the inside is like a white jelly. And there's seeds in there, so you gotta be careful, but it's really good. Oh no, I dropped that one. But this, it's sour like right next to the skin. Mmm. Like a sweet and a sour. It's like candy. Here's a good one. They're kind of slimy like a like a booger. It's pretty deep. Like neck deep right here. Oh. There's one. Yep. This one's nicer. Dang, Noah said he saw a garp bike. That's a nice bass right there. Hey y'all, just doing a little river fishing right here and I landed this nice river bass. This is the biggest bass I've ever caught in the river. Nice little largemouth looks like. Yeah, it is. He was right where this cold water, right where this cold water comes out of this spring. Like I can feel the temperature difference right here. And he's right on the edge of that cool water. So when you catch one fish, the vultures show up. <laughs> oh, what do you mean? oh yeah, where, really, where? You. Me? Oh. <laughs> the minnows can hear that blade, or they see it because they they jump out of the way of your bait. Ooh, there was one right there. Oh, ooh, that's nice. That's a that's a guad. Okay. Yeah, see how he's got those stripes? Like a smallmouth? Yeah. On the hunt for that elusive guad right there. He hit it right here. Like right next to me. Look at the colors on this guy. That's cool, huh? You see the difference? Yeah. See these cheeks? See how he's got those stripes? Yeah. And see how that, when you close his mouth, it doesn't go past his eye. Cute little guad. That was a guad too. He didn't even have red eyes or nothing. Got one. <laughs> oh, that was a guad too. Ooh, there's a big fish right there. I don't know if you can see it, but it is right there. Oh, oh, he, he ate it. I think it's a gar pike. scared it away. Darn it. I don't know if you can see that, but that was awesome. Woo! Happy 4th of July, everybody. Them boats in the back. It was a good day fishing. It was a lot of fun, but uh, it's getting busy. Everybody's drinking. We're going to call it a day. We caught some nice river bass. That ticket was that Roadrunner. It, it, was, it worked out perfect. Thank you guys for watching, and fish, learn, repeat. We'll catch you on the next one. There's one. Yep.